how a VND exchange slash RV would work for us. Given that the most plausible and logical way for a country like Vietnam, or Iraq for that matter, to be able to pay for our exchanges at a significantly higher rate than today's 24,000 VND to 1 US dollar rate, is for the current USD to be significantly devalued against the VND. Think about it, if foreigners outside of Vietnam are holding many trillions of VND, at a new rate of say 1.00 VND equals 0 US dollars and 10 cents, 10 US cents, Vietnam would have to come up with literally trillions of US dollars to buy our VND at the new rate. This is simply economically impossible, given Vietnam's gross domestic product, GDP, today, is likely around $450 billion. However, if the VND became directly convertible into a gold-backed global currency, the US dollar, along with all other fiat currencies would be extremely weak by comparison. This is where the BRICS, gold-backed common trade currency, comes into play. If Vietnam becomes a member of the BRICS alliance, the VND would be directly convertible into the new, BRICS gold-backed trade currency and thus, by extension, the VND we all hold would be directly exchanged into the golden trade currency. Furthermore, since the USD, Euro, etc., would be near worthless against the BRICS gold currency, we would have tremendous purchasing power in our home countries. How much purchasing power? That would depend on the ultimate structure of how BRICS would manage each of its members' native currency to the new, gold-backed, common trade currency. Consequently, it's not realistically possible to determine what our VND exchange value would ultimately be at this time.